everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Mosley and today I have a new video for you. So today I'm gonna talk about some recently just launched facial mask, at least in my local area. And I'm talking about something from drugstore, which is also very affordable. I'm talking about St. Ives um, glowing sheet mask. So I recently just got it, like literally three days ago, I got it from my local CVS. Um, I'm pretty sure I've seen it in my local Walmart and my local Target. So um, if my place is launching this, you probably can get it anywhere. So yeah, and this sheet mask is like, I think it has four or five of these in the you know, whole series. I only get one of these because um, I know recently all these drugstore brands, they have come up so many, so many different facial masks. And I do want to try one of each series, which means I have a whole ton to try out. So I'm only trying out this one today. Um, and on here it says made with 100% natural extract, so that's very nice. Um, it says one sheet mask, do not flush me. I really like this sign because like some people don't know you cannot flush this. Um, and it's paraben free, dermatologist detected and tested 100% cotton for the sheet. So I get a vibe, it's all natural. And it says it revives skin for a fresh glow. So this is supposed to be like a reviving kind of, kind of giving you like, I don't know, like more of brightening within. I'm getting sort of that vibe. Um, on the back, it says dish to dull the sheet mag with 100% uh, natural extra help refresh skin so you can bring on the glow. So like I said, it's help you to glow within. And, and it's literally, um, says all, all about how to put this on and this mask uh, interestingly it says live on for 10 minutes right here live on for 10 minutes so that's actually very surprising because if you see my recent videos you know most of the masks you leave on for 15 minutes and this for 10 so I kind of expect it has less serum within it um, and it does not really say anything about how much it weigh or how many um, serum in, in here. Um, it also also does not really talk about where is this mask made. Um, so we have a lot of information that we don't really know so far, but I hope this is pretty good. Um, I hope this is worth the price. And talking about the price, I think it, this is like two fifty or something, but I'm not sure. Let me check real quick. Yeah, so this retail for two forty nine in Target. Um, so. If you have seen my other videos, you know this is supposed to be a little bit um, over the middle area for myself for what I've tested. It's not super expensive, but also it's not very, very cheap if you think of this mask only have you live on for 10 minutes. But on the other hand, it's probably the same size as the Jelly Mask from Clean & Clear I have reviewed before, so if you think of that, I really don't know how to think of this price. But we shall see how it works later, and see you in a bit. I'm on my own, broken alone. I feel the rain crashing down all around this empty town. I'm searching for the lost and found, but you don't care. I just washed my face. My face is squeaky clean right now. Um, it does feel very soft. That's my first impression. Um, I don't know if you can see the glow part. I don't really notice a big difference on the glow. Um, but I do think generally I do have a very good in, um, impression about this mask. So first of all, right off the package, it's very moisturizing. Um, I'm very happy about how how much serum it has in the packet because it says 10 minutes I literally did not expect that much serum would be in the packaging so it was very nice I took it out and literally the serum was dripping down and it's not the same one as the jelly mask from clean and clear it's just liquidy no this one it actually feels like serum so I do like it a lot um, and for the size, I have to mention the size because I don't know you all if you have any of the problem before but Kurt, I 
sometimes I would have a problem that that facial mask doesn't make my, like doesn't fit my face because my face is like so wide right here. Um, that one fits my face pretty well. It covers pretty much everywhere that I want it to be at. It literally, I have a little bit extra on my chin, so it covers a little bit around here. I'm pretty satisfied with that bit. I think the size is very very well. If you're a girl who also has a wide face like me, you probably really like this one. Um, for the scent, it does have a scent, um, like, oh, it's not very, very light, but if you put it on your face after five minutes, you, you, it's true, you cannot smell it anymore. Um, but if you open the packaging, you just put it on your face, there is a strong scent. Um, I think it's an apricot scent that's supposed to be, because I have used your, um, if you have used your facial scrub before, I think this is the same scent, but I'm not sure, because I haven't used it for a long while. Um, but if you have um, tried both of them, and you think they're the same, please leave a comment down below. Um, yeah, so it does have a scent. If you're very sensitive to that, your skin is very sensitive, I do not recommend you to try this on, just because, you know, like, fragrance is not good. And um, for the time, my time alarm was 16 minutes, and then I'd put it on and then take it off at around 40 minutes or so. So I have to say, at around 40 minutes, I feel like I could still going after I applied the little bit more serum left in the package. However, personally, I just prefer it not to go that dry for the mask, so I take it off at 14 minutes, which is 4 minutes over than what package says which is very, very nice. I do think it's well worth the money that I paid for. Um, also, um, this mask, when it goes on my face, it does not have a lot of air bubble cracks and stuff. So it, it does pretty much cover my face very, very well. Um, if you have seen the footage, you know, there isn't any much air bubbles in my face and it fits very well. I don't have to adjust it over and over again. So all in all, I think this is a very good mask, but does it give me a glow? I can't, I, I don't know. Could you all who are watching this video can leave a comment down below. Tell me if you think it gives me a glow. Uh, currently, I'm I'm shooting. I, I cannot tell the difference. Uh, but if you use it as a like moisturizing mask, just like a pamper and I want to try it out. Yes, definitely. So for this mask and thinking about the price, I would give it a four out of five. Um, it's a generally very good mask. I do like it. Um, it's very convenient to get. So yeah, that's the end of this video. If you like this video, please leave a comment down below or give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Um, and uh, if you have any more ideas you want me to try out, please leave a comment down below too. And I'll see you next time. Bye!